hello guys welcome to my channel thank you for joining me if you are new to the channel don't forget to subscribe like and share this video if you are a returning subscriber i really appreciate your support uh, so keep on watching keep on liking the video um yeah and all that good stuff so in today's video i just want to share um an update on the um on the parcel that i bought with tigmo because um i was trying out tigmo for the first time and uh, so far um i feel i haven't been satisfied with the um, uh, services and um and i bought a parcel with tigmo and I, a few days before that i bought a parcel with iShop so it only had like um, i think i'll put the screenshot of the dates on which i bought the two parcels and um so the first one i bought was i used iShop and the second one i bought i used tigmo so this was to experiment on the services how fast and quick and um how how best they handle the parcels so on the on the first hand um i used um iShop and with iShop my parcel was delivered um within three weeks as uh, estimated and uh, their services were very good and um, although uh, the only difference is that um iShop is on the bit higher side and i feel this is because of their quality in their services uh, meanwhile on the other hand we have um, tigmo so with tigmo their price of uh, ship their shipping price is a bit lower but uh, also their quality is also i feel to me right now is almost um, very poor because uh, i bought uh, i don't know but i would i bought the parcel on this date i'll put the the, the screenshot and um, it was shipped to them but uh, when it arrived to them so when i bought the parcel with uh, um, with tigmo it uh, it traveled okay but uh, so when i reached uh, iShop uh, sorry tigmo um it reached on the i think i will link the date i've forgotten the date it reached uh, from ebay and then uh, for like four or five days i didn't receive the email that um it has reached so i had to call them i had to text them and uh, so i emailed them that i haven't received the parcel and uh, they told me to give them the tracking number and uh, i i provided the tracking number and um, i was um, the, the parcel was uh, updated on my account but um, so good uh, good enough um, on the on the 6th it was updated and then on the so uh, on um, on the 9th on the 6th it was uh, updated on my account that they have received and on the uh, on the 9th it was shipped to zambia and uh, on the 19th it was uh, uh, delivered here in zambia so on my account it said uh, it has been received at the international at the lusaka international airport something like that so since the 19th up to now uh, i haven't received any email so i have tried to email them they say okay give me your your tracking number which i've provided nothing has happened i've tried to call them they say oh we don't know what's happening your parcel should be there by now and uh, we need to we'll update you on what will happen so i have called them numerous times they they haven't responded back and also um so on the 19th it was a uh, it was it, it reached um osaka um international airport and then um today is the 3rd of january and then on the 19th of uh, december 2022 that's when it um, arrived in zambia but uh, it has taken now over today makes it about uh, 12 days to reach in dollar so which is supposed to be a one day trip but um right now it's uh, almost 12 days and uh, i don't quite know why because my experience with um i shop is that uh, whenever i buy something when it reaches uh, lusaka so when it creates custom 
uh, in, in a day or two, I will receive my parcel here in Indora without any doubts. But uh, for this one, I'm quite disappointed because um, up to now, I haven't received the parcel. And also, when I reach, when I reach out to them, their response is not always satisfied, satisfying because um, they usually don't have enough information about the parcel. Even when I provide my tracking number, my, my, my username, they check, oh, it's still in Lusaka Airport, we'll get back to you. That's the only feedback I get. So uh, this is uh, quite shock, uh, 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 disappointing because um, when, um, when I bought with iShop, it was like a days, days after. So days before I bought with Tigmo, I bought with iShop and I wanted to experiment on the two, um, two uh, shipping companies. And uh, iShop already delivered. I think I'll put uh, the, the screenshot from the day I bought from the day it was received to the day I um, to the day I received here in Indola. So um, for iShop, I think it has it is late with um, a week or two, if not days, because it was shipped quite okay. But um, the day I the the only thing that I'm very much disappointed is that. Um, from Lusaka to Ndola, it has taken over 13 days to reach, which uh, my experience with uh, Tigmo or with iShop is that uh, whenever I buy something, when it reaches custom, uh, within a day or two, then the parcel will be here in Ndola. So this is my update on, um, on Tigmo and how they have been, uh, their services have been. So far, I, I have not yet collected the parcel, Hopefully by this week I will correct and I'll make a video about it because it's my first time using uh, Tigmo. And um, so uh, also if you want to, to, to know more, you can join our WhatsApp group. I'll link the, the link in the description. And also you can reach out to me. You'll find me in the, in the WhatsApp group. Uh, that's it for now. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Your support is highly appreciated. Thank you. See you in my next video.